So the Slipknot cosmetics are finally in Dead by Daylight with a ton of cool different masks. We're going to take a look at all of them and showcase the more easy sort of masks that you can actually see. Let's jump on into it. So here we are. The Slipknot collection is here. Let's take a look at all of the cool things that we have. First of all, we have the entire new set. And this is the Subliminal Menace, aka Frank. A sinister scratching noise shattered the shifting atmosphere of the realm. And Frank watched as his mask and clothes began to change. This is pretty damn cool. I'm not gonna lie. Take a look at how cool that looks. I really do like that cosmetic. Next up, we have the Ashen Quake. A spine chilling growl echoed through the realm and the trapper found his predatory instincts concealed behind a new wicked grin. This is definitely probably my personal favorite cosmetic, especially since it's on my boy Trapper. This is looking really stellar. Next up, we have the Metallic Grill. This is really, really awesome as well. I really like the mask that they have. I know a few people said that this cosmetic should have been for the night. Uh, I can kind of see that, but still, I'm, I'm pretty happy that this is on the Wraith. This looks pretty nice as well. Overall, this is probably my second or third favorite up here, except for the set. We're not counting the set, but th this one's really good too. Here's the awesome Billy cosmetic that we've been seeing as well, the engraved flesh. This is really nice. Low frequency vibrations reverberated through the realm, distracting the hillbilly from the destructive frenzy. He stood in the middle of the cornfield, clutching the mask of flesh that spread across his disfigured face. Next up, we have the zipper mouthpiece cosmetic for the doctor. And it says a mask appeared on the doctor's disturbing face after the unsettling tones of distant keyboard echoed through the realm. Again, this one is okay. Again, these are all references to Slipknot as well. Just as a cosmetic and someone that's not a fan of Slipknot, to me, this is just okay. Uh, but still, pretty cool nonetheless. Next up, we have the Grim Circus for the Clown. From behind the new mask, the clown cackled at the thunderous clanging that resounded through the realm. The Dead Slinger has the dominant eye. The Dead Slinger set his sights on the target as the raw sound of the guitar strings erupted in the realm. He grinned and opened fire as an enormous mask manifested over his face. Molded Visage is what we have for the Blight. As a rapid fire pounding echoed through the realm, a gruesome mask wrapped itself around the Blight's face, Serum gurgling from his maw. Now something cool as well, when you actually load in, I'm going to have to unfortunately keep talking so I don't get a copyright strike, but if you load in with any of these masks, you'll actually hear a song playing in the background from Slipknot, which is pretty damn cool. I'm happy they included this feature. Unfortunately, like I said, I can't really stop talking or else it'll pick it up as a copyright. So you can listen for yourself if you buy any of these cosmetics, but that is a really cool and neat feature. But there you go, those are all of the Slipknot cosmetics that we have in the game. Let me know how you guys feel about this. Again, as I said in a few videos, I'm not personally a big Slipknot fan. I'm not a Die Hard fan. I really don't know much about them. So I'm very curious on your opinion. If you're a Slipknot fan, 
how do you feel about these cosmetics and how do you feel they stack up against the Iron Maiden collection? Because of course there's going to be some comparisons. I would love to know your feedback in your comments down below and I think in the future I will be doing a giveaway for some of these awesome cosmetics so we'll do an Oryxel giveaway. If you want to partake in that make sure you guys are following me over on twitch.tv slash the king. The next time we go live which hopefully is tomorrow every single weekday we'll try to be live which will be 12 p.m until 4 or 5 p.m eastern standard time that's when we're going to be doing some of these awesome giveaways that'll probably take place tomorrow along with some of the unknown dlc stuff so make sure you guys are following a big thank you for all the love and support recently as well if you guys did enjoy make sure you sub down below tell me how you feel about these cosmetics and as always i'm the king i tip my crown to you guys and we'll see you in the fog